what's up guys welcome back to another video today i just wanted to run you guys through a quick tutorial on how you can get back to racing with your wheel on xbox it seems with the recent update from xbox and ea there's a big error where the game keeps freezing your xbox freezes you have to turn it off and there's no way to continue so i'm gonna show you guys just a quick fix obviously xbox should be fixing this soon but if you're still struggling this might solve your problems in the meantime get you back to racing so to start you're gonna want to make sure your wheel is unplugged or turned off I have the Fanatec, I can just leave it turned off. If you have a Thrustmaster or of the other sorts, just unplug it from your Xbox and use your controller to start this next step. So you're gonna start just by clicking the Xbox button and we're gonna go all the way down to the bottom here to the search and we're gonna type in Xbox Insider Hub. So mine's already installed, but it's gonna be this black icon right here. It's a pretty small app, so it should only take a few minutes to download. And once you have it installed, you're gonna accept and join all the features that pop up at first obviously i already have mine up so you're not going to see that but you'll get through it just click join accept all of that once you get in we're going to go down to previews and you're going to look for this right here xbox update preview again mine's already joined and installed you're going to want to download that that may take a little longer um, and it'll say pending for probably a few minutes maybe five ten minutes so give it some time to accept and once you have it accepted we're gonna exit all the way back out. Click the Xbox button, and we're gonna go over all the way to the right to settings. Once you get the settings, go down to system, updates. And once you get here, you should have a new update and install that. That might take a little longer again, 20, 30 minutes, depending on your internet connection. But once you have this installed, restart your console, start it back up, and you'll be able to get back to racing. That's all I wanted to share with you guys today. Just looking through a lot of forums, a lot of people are still having issues, not being able to play a lot of games, mainly the ones that are EA games in conjunction with your wheel. So let me know if that worked for you. Like and subscribe, and thanks for watching.